King Charles, Queen Camilla, Prince William and Prince Harry all shared the royal residence. Queen Camilla and King Charles have lived at Clarence House since 2003, two years before their wedding, but it was previously the residence of many other members of the royal family. Hello viewers, welcome to Royal Info Mate. Please make sure to subscribe and hit the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British monarchy. Not only did the Queen Mother live in the London property from 1953 until her death in 2002, but Prince William and Prince Harry also moved into the four-story home the same year as their father. While William left home after marrying Princess Kate in 2011, his younger brother continued to live there until 2012. It's well documented that the King made many changes to the royal residence before moving there, including updated color schemes, personal artwork, and new furnishings, but Queen Camilla also made sure to leave her mark on her property. According to the Duke of Sussex, he might care that his stepmother had made a major change to her specific living space. Remembering the moment his wife Meghan Markle first visited Clarence House, he wrote in spare, I had also mentioned that I had lived here at Clarence House from the age of 19 until at about 28. After that. When I moved out, Camilla turned my bedroom into a walk-in closet. I tried not to worry about it. But especially when I first saw it, I did not care. The Duke moved into William and Kate's former home, Nottingham Cottage, in 2013 and stayed there until after his royal wedding to Meghan Markle in May 2018. Harry admitted he had hoped to spend more time with the Prince and Princess of Wales and their young children to spend since they lived so close to each other. They were half a football field away, just behind a stone courtyard, so close that I could constantly see their nanny walking by with the stroller and hear their elaborate renovations. I thought they would have me with them at all times. Now. Every day dot but day after day it didn't happen. I see, I thought. You're busy? Starting a family. Or maybe. They don't want a third wheel. Maybe things will be different when I get married. He wrote. Harry and Meghan then moved to Frogmore Cottage in Windsor in early 2019 where they briefly lived with their son Prince Archie. The Duke justified his decision to move to another royal residence by saying not cot was charming but too small apostrophe. The couple reportedly spent £2.4 million, which they later paid back to the taxpayer, renovating a posh family home before quitting their roles as senior royals and moving to the US. While they have made a few visits to their British home in recent years, Charles is said to have asked for the keys in 2023 following the release of Spare. It is now unclear where Harry stays during his visits. The accommodation he chose is believed to be a hotel after returning to the UK to visit his father, King Charles, following his cancer diagnosis in February. OK that's it for this episode. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments section below. Please like, share and subscribe for more.